freed nine one zero two three Ah. Is there nothing else? Wait. I can't even read my own writing. I just wrote it down. I can't read my own writing. Oh my goodness. Can I please take the data pad with me? Good lord. Yeah, F R E E D. Zero one nine one zero two three. Who is this? Stefan or Stefan? Is this Stefan? No, it's Roger. Damn it! So how do I proceed? Okay. To the spacesuit room, key card, and door. Is there nothing else here? Oh, wait. Duh! She's got... A oh, hello. <sighs> you didn't expect to find anyone alive in here, did you? No. It's just all of them were once alive. There's nothing you can do about them now, Rachel. I know. Have you found anything interesting? Not really. This corpse is already way beyond recognition. Okay... Window to surgery. The abandoned surgical room has been kept clean. All right, we're not going to go in there just yet. Medical tools are scattered across the floor. Do you want me to clean up in here? No. no there's no point in that. Data pad. Who's data pad? Ah, it's Stephens. All right. F R E E E D. Nine one zero oh, two three. Confirm. Hey, Stefan Pree, civilian research, personal ID number 6672347855. stroke seven eight five five three. Um, consistent. After what we did, Ambrosia, it's much harder for me to stay focused. We were never really ready for alien. Con Whoa, Ambrosia, alien contact. Act like complete idiot. I wonder if Yambushi would have rushed this mission, and if it hadn't been for Jason Quincy's. What? Decided to split us up and only send the most stable crew members here while he stayed behind to supervise the crew left on the probe. Only five of us made the cut, although I wonder... Okay. So Lark actually is on the ship. All right. Nothing but soothing sand. Um... Okay. That place actually hit a secret. Last night we heard strange sounds coming from the desert. Contact the probe. But the answer was negative. I wonder what me local acoustic ph phenomenon on. Sound is back. Maria says it originates from organic life form, but all the readings on the probe are negative. Apparently, it's just us and sand. Still creeps me out. Roger went berserk. He rushed in from the desert, screaming that something tried to eat him alive. He didn't even have a scratch on him. I think this place is messing with our minds. Strange sound returns tonight. Seems louder and closer than before. Benjamin found out the sound is always returns at the same time every day. He set up an external microphone and wrote a program which detects a sharp amplitude change. Clever. And set a trap. Oh. Something happened. I was woken up by a heavy pounding. It was of someone hammering nails right into my brain. Everyone was on their feet stumbling around trying to find out what the heck was going on. If we were able to get outside, it stopped. Next morning, we went outside to find a strange creature substance all around the station. I'm rather clueless. I wish Rachel was here. She was so good with that kind of stuff. Hey, wait. I'm Rachel. Huh? All right. Uh, communication was probably... Oh, okay. They lost communication. Roger's going nuts. All right. How to return tonight makes matters worse. Our main inner generator is toast. We also need to take turns replacing the containers. I must have forget. RTL Nog. Oh, joy. Wait, RTL Nog? What is that? That's got to be something important. RTL Nog. RTLNOG. It this got her. Might actually what? be useful. Let's try creating normal air conditions in here. Okay. When the sink emerged from the sand, it bit her in two. Oh my god. I was already set the correct levels for the air generator. Tricky business, but I figured it out eventually. Important numbers to remember are twenty point nine and one point one. Of course, it's only air after all. Uh, also, I had to crank up the fans to maximum and lower them immediately. 
expel the bad air inside. All right. Today is my container day. Wish me luck. Uh, apparently, you lost out, my friend. Just standard medical junk. These are expired anyway. Okay. Oh, no, we already looked at the card. Microscope. An ordinary microscope. It's oh. obvious that the main technology focus was elsewhere. Yep. X-rays. Just look at this, Julia. The damage to the bones is quite peculiar. Parts are actually missing. What is your take on it? If it wasn't utter nonsense, I would think the leg was chewed on. May I suggest a possible act of cannibalism? I don't think so. Let's look around some more. That's disturbing. All right, let's see. The door. All right, there's a memory card. Would have never seen that door. Container. Another container. Okay. The door is broken beyond repair. Ah. Okay, let's uh, let's go to our analyzer. Let's analyze the laser gun. Bio. Cover correlation of these prints. Match with Stefan prints. Okay. Never been fired. All right. Well, that's probably a good thing. Data now. Ooh, what's this? Oh, hello. Okay. That was a rather large creature of some description. All right, so we have to do something. The air. Wait, can I get in here? I can. All right, there's a ladder. Another container. That looks like a container for a backup air generator. Tools. Obviously, someone has been trying to interrupt the station power supply. Okay. Documents. The scattered documents are the station's electrical wiring schematic. There's a door there. Status screen. This screen once showed vital station information. Now it's useless. Great. Okay, so where are we exactly? Okay, we have to be... Okay, we're here. So the toilets are here. Okay, and then a ladder. Let's go this way. Oh, never mind. Going this way. Where are we? Oh, that's the living area. All right. Body. Examine. That body? Look at his hands. They're tightly clenched. Do you think he died of asphyxiation, Julia? It looks more like shock. We need to examine the body to find out more. Observation. He has an ID card in his pocket. I am recovering it now. Did she just talk to herself instead of the... Okay, mm, no. No, this one looks different. All right. Obtain a sample. You got a sample. All right. We, we got samples. Data pad. Oh, good grief. Can I... Nope. I cannot. All right. That was... Who was that? Done forgot already. Benjamin Walter. All right. Food leftovers. Rotten junk food leftovers. Mmm, junk food. Rubbish. Commentary. The outside view is pretty boring. Only tons of sand blown by the wind. Oh, Mobot. You almost seem romantic. Clarification. Unlike you, my unit isn't equipped with emotional AI. I don't know what it is, but I've got a bad feeling about this place. Maybe the giant um, monster! Superstitious, Rachel? Not a bit. Just something feels so wrong. The environment. Everything. It simply doesn't make sense with what we see in here. Aha. Uh -huh. Hanging cables. Commentary. The electricity wiring is in very bad condition. Whatever it was, it shook the station badly. Okay. This window has been broken from the outside. That is interesting considering the extreme strength of the material. Right. These two Just are a few serious. Of sand and bam, the window is broken. These people are crazy. Okay. Station computer, station computer. Maintenance card. Engineering department. Okay. 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 Now look at this. It looks like another upgrade. Let me analyze the schematics. Please do. My mouse is impacted. I think that so. this upgrade enhances mobile. Ooh, we found audio the audio. Abilities. Really? What will he be able to do now? 
One part is obviously a much more sensitive microphone while the rest deals with signal processing. We found the thing we need. Okay. Incorrect air. Link loss, link loss. Okay, air control. Okay. Can't do anything. All right, we got to we got to fix that. All right, any other What's that? Food left over. More of this stuff. My kingdom for a steak. Mm, steak. All right. So, oh my goodness, more of it. Food porn. <laughs> <laughs> Diagram. These diagrams represent the central air and electrical circuits. Okay, so we've now explored everything we can get our hands on. So let's go. We take the ladder. The ladder once led to the space shuttle. Is it still accessible? Unfortunately not. The entrance has been blocked by the explosion. All right. Let's uh, let's back out. Uh, we're gonna have to go outside. Has to be something over here then. Okay, I need to analyze. Oh, wait, let's analyze the body sample. <laughs> what the hell did he see out there? That's a heart attack, probably caused by shock of extremely the ground. Body was pressed against the window before it collapsed to the ground. Wow. Benjamin Walters. Wow. Benji, you died hard, dude. This slot is to insert the container for the station backup air generator. Okay, so we've removed the things. Now we have to go get the things from inside, apparently. Okay, we've acquired one. Two. The other one was this way. Okay. Let me go back outside. Go back over here. All right. It's not our right to left nitrogen, oxygen, something. This slot is. Can I? Maybe I need to analyze. Ah, analyze. Chemical analysis, synthesized nitrogen. All right. Nitrogen, oxygen, and then G. What is the G? Synthesized oxygen. RTL nog is right to left. Lesser gases and breathable. Okay, that makes sense then. All right. Uh, nitrogen, oxygen, gas. Now we go back inside. And then this thing, maintenance guard, station controls. No. No. I need. Right. I was an idiot. I said. I am detecting a strange phenomenon. Just what the hell is that? I am not sure I want to know. My scanners don't show anything, though. It was the monster. Um, I wonder if you, I wonder if there's a failure state in this game. Nitrogen. Right to left. Dare learn your right and your left. I don't want to learn my right from my left. Okay. Maintenance guard. Maintenance. Aha! Turn on. Turn off. Oh, wait. Hold on. Oxygen. It's going to be 20.9. Whoa, no, 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 no. 20, oops, okay, 1.1, 1. 1. okay, and 20.9, there, Ooh. 
It looks like you've nailed it. I'm locking the gas ratio controls. Okay. Now let's wait a little bit for the air to be replaced. That should be enough. Now we need to lower the airflow to exactly one half. Woohoo, we did it! We've been able to restore the air in here. Yeah! We are rock stars. What does that do for us, though? I mean, honestly, what, what does that do for us? I mean, I can't... Is there anything else in here? And there's this data pad. That was Pre's. He gave us the figures. Uh I am unable. Right. The keypad is locked. So where's that coming from? Wait, wires? Observation. The power has been manually interrupted. Probably a safety measure to prevent further explosions. So can we fix it now? No. I don't know what the key is. There's too many possible combinations. There's something in here I'm missing then. Uh, I got this guy's data pad, but it's locked. We have no idea what Benjamin Walter's data pad set is. Or do we? Do we? Do we? Do we? Do we? No. We don't. All right, let's go. Is there anything here then? No, just the door. Attention. Then I wonder if it's some likely so. How so? It appears to be quite vulnerable. We'll find a way. All right, that's that was that conversation. Is there anything here I missed? This is Marie does. That doesn't do me any good. And sick bay doesn't seem to have anything. <sighs> Wait, does the maintenance card have... No, that has the acoustics processor. There's something here I'm missing then. No. Here? No. No, we're good there. So we're missing something. Roger Callens. I didn't get any data on Roger or Benji here. And both of them are, yeah, both of them are too strong. I don't have anything else except for another sticky substance. Yeah, nothing really great. Um, do you think maybe we need to go to another planet? I think we might need to go to another planet and then come back here. So I think we'll do that in our next three-part section of our indie adventure here with Julie Among the Stars. We'll go... Actually, you know what we'll do? Well, before we do that, let's... um. Let's jump back to the ship, go to our workbench. We'll go ahead and make this thing, because why not? Okay, and then, oops. yep. All right, so then we need that. And 
that. I've got three of those, a couple of those. That to go here. So there's nothing preventing me from putting that there. That. Putting snake here. So, and then this guy that. So now I got three and three. One, two, three, one, two. But then all these enemies are me two. Something's not right about that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that and that. Can I go? So... That leaves materially short. Ha ha ha! I know what I need to do. I know what I need to do. It's a trick. You think that you need to do things like that, but this is what you actually need to do. By doing it this way, we move the entire construct far enough along uh, this thing that we're able to Oop. so so maybe not there we'll have to think about that one's positioning This goes like this. All right, and then this. That's that. That. But that won't work. What do I need to do? I need to do something. think need this to go like that like that now like that Forgot about that. All right. So, snake head thing. Oop. And boom, construct. That's it. Yeah. So you have a new signal processor for Mubot. Which is Jeffrey. Look at him. Look at Jeffrey. He's all smart and stuff. We got two more slots. Woohoo! All right. So that's a, that's been our three episodes of the Indie Adventure here, Julie Among the Stars. Next time, I think we're going to jump back and do the auto processing on that one planet and maybe jump the planet that we've been screwing around with. Um, I don't know how, I don't know what I'm going to do. I think I need a powerful hacker or something. I don't know. We'll find out. Until then, I've been Derek Tevers. This has been your indie adventure, Julia Among the Stars. Mm -hmm.